what's up guys welcome back to my channel yes i know it's been like five weeks or more than that since i've actually even done a video it's because i've been actually enjoying the boat i've been going out almost every weekend so this weekend has been kind of like raining so i've been trying to do this project for a while now i'm installing two more speakers on this boat so you guys know i already have one on under each seat let me show you real quick there's one and there's two and I'm installing two more so I have an idea where to put it so yeah guys so stay tuned I might do a voiceover and uh, that way because I always have I have the fan on and you guys are not gonna be able to hear me and it's hot guys it is freaking hot oh and guys don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel I usually do things like this I usually modify my boat uh, I do mo more modifications than going out fishing, but eventually I'll go and make a awesome fishing video. But right now I'm just trying to make my boat the way I like it. So stay tuned guys. All right, so I was gonna go ahead and uh, mount it diagonal like this, but the only bad thing about it is it overlaps the deck. So sideways like this is actually perfect. Uh, and I mounted it close to that storage compartment uh, Make sure if you do install something like this always use stainless steel screws uh, Trust me. They're a little bit more expensive, but it's worth it. So I went ahead and did that. It's secure It's good. It's not going anywhere and I went ahead and ran the first wire through the uh, speaker box and you could actually tuck it in where the door opens and it's nice and hidden and it doesn't look like a mess uh, you will have a little piece of wire showing but it doesn't bother me and I just you know ran it all the way around the live well uh, tucked it in with you could use like a screwdriver something flat to kind of push it in and underneath you could actually tuck it in right there where that little corner is and it doesn't go through on the other side I'll show you that later and keep tucking it in where the, your control unit is and it'll come out right there and you want to get a drill you're gonna have to drill your boat drill it and make sure you use a big enough drill bit that way both wires could actually fit through there and then you want to drill it again through the bigger storage compartment so remember drill it under the seat if you have a bass tracker like me and then drill it through the uh, storage compartment on the back and yes I'm using marine graded um, speaker wire because if you don't, if you use regular speaker wires, they do corrode just like the old speakers I have. Guys, I'm almost done. I already wired most of these. I'm gonna get electrical tape real quick. Um, and some uh, connectors to connect the ends of the speaker. <clears throat> All right, down here, I was gonna tell you guys. Down here, I don't know if you can see, right there where my finger is, you can actually tuck it in right there. That way it doesn't show and it's nice and neat and trust me it won't come through the other side. Alright, so I'm gonna go get some more parts because you know battery sold separately and it didn't come with the little end piece. And I will install probably the lights another day. <laughs> Alright, and just like that, I, I wanna say four hours passed, but I finally got it done. I rewired all the speaker wires for the fronts uh, I do got to change the speaker wires for the under the seat right here because they have regular speaker wires and so don't have marine graded wires I also added cup holders I got one right there and I also got one right here hidden I like this spot right here because it's out of the Sun because every time I invite friends over they're like where are the cup holders I'm like well this boat only came with one cup holder so hold your drink <laughs> oh and here's a short video of it with a uh, music on <laughs> 